What do you do in a Phoenix app if something is spamming your logs repeatedly, like say your hosting service, like AWS's Heartbeat, or in this case, it's uh, Veet, which I used to build the front end, is trying to ping uh, a tab that's disconnected. And it's just filling up your IEX terminal. And uh, not only can you not really type anything to debug, you can't even read uh, what does come up on the screen before it goes off. Hey, what's up? It's Mark at alchemist.camp, where we learn Elixir and Phoenix by building things. Today, we're going to answer this question. So as you're probably familiar, you can set logger levels on a per environment basis. So for example, here, we're in test.exs and we're looking at uh, the logger level warning. So this will display warnings and more important things like errors, but it won't display less important things like uh, debug info. And we can set a different level for dev and different level for prod. But these are all global in the sense that they apply to every single route. If we want to change uh, the logging behavior or suppress it on a given route, then what we need to do is customize it. And depending on your app, if it's old, you might see plug logger. And if it's a newer one, you'll see plug telemetry and then some options. Uh, in either case, what you have to do is customize logger or customize telemetry. I'm going to show how to do it with telemetry since that's uh, what newer generators are going to create and any newer apps will have, but it's a very similar uh, process either way. So in my campsite web directory, which is my main app web, I've got a plugs directory where I just put various plugs that I've set up. I'm going to make a new one called telemetry.ex and in here we'll call it campsite web dot plugs dot telemetry telemetry and this is going to be a plug so we're going to implement behavior plug and that means we need to implement init and call so this was copilot suggestion for init we actually want to proxy this to plug telemetry init so when uh init is called we'll just our function or our module will just use the init from the default plug telemetry that phoenix has out of the box and now we need to do call and for call well i gotta say uh, copilot is getting more useful for elixir than i remember it being um for call we have uh, the same thing here we're just passing it off to plug telemetry so this entire module as is uh, would have no effect if we swap out plug telemetry with it now we just have our module but um, for init we're using the built-in init and for call same thing what we want to do since we don't want to have exactly the same behavior is we want to define another function head for call and have this match the routes that uh, uh, that we care about in this case it's under under vite under ping so in fact i think i'll leave that up just so we can see the progress as we go through this so we want to match on the con and we'll look at the path info when the path info which is a list the first item in there is under under vite under ping then uh, we still need to match the con then instead of passing the con to plug telemetry call what we'll do is we'll send a response of 200 okay uh shape just 200 so plug.con.send resp 200 and we don't need to say anything then we'll halt the we'll halt the plug so plug.con or halt the con i should say halt and that's it we're not going to pass it off to telemetry we're not going to do anything else so you can see in the default case, we just let it pass through to telemetry. But if the path matches this one, then we just send OK and halt. All right. Now, in order to use this new this new module that we made, we need to go back to uh, we need to go back to endpoint.ex, and we'll replace plug telemetry with campsite web 
.plugs.telemetry. And as soon as this recompiles, we should see the spamming end in the terminal. And we do. Hope you found this useful. I'll see you next time.